Hi, in this video we will analyze what task-based UI is about and also how to design a task-based UI. Task-based UI is all about designing UI based on the user intent. But what is an user intent? User intent is the action that an user wants to do in business perspective. This will be clear with an example. This is an employee management portal that is used to manage employee records. If you notice closely, this UI is nothing but an interface to a database table as what this UA provides is effectively all CRUD operations to that employee table. So this type of UA is called as CRUD based UA. Now to convert to task based UA, we need to identify the user intent. So what are the user intents here? User intent largely varies based on the context. As an exercise, Pause the video for a few seconds and try to identify user intents in this given example. I can see three user intents in this UI. First one is updating personal details like first name, last name and date of birth for a an user. And second one is being activating or deactivating in the user. And the final one is changing the role of an user. Converting this based on the user intents would be something like this. This UI clearly demarcates various intents of the user and now the user will be clear on what to click based on what she intended to do. Only the fields necessary for the context is shown to the user. Example, only role field is presented to the user when changing the role of an employee. This is called as task-based UI. Coming to the advantages, UI will be more intuitive as now the design is guided based on the user goals rather than the database table. Configuring UI for various scenarios will be easier. Example, we can easily hide or show deactivate link based on the role of the user, which is easier than hiding or showing bunch of fields in the CRUD based UI. Third one is we can have more fine grained APIs for each user intent. This will allow us to have role based security on these APIs. Example, we can configure deactivate API to be invoked only by super admins, etc. Implementing this role-based security for a CRUD-based API will be cumbersome as it will require multiple if-else statement based on what the field is being updated. Hope this served you as a starting point to explore more about task-based UI and the technical possibilities it offers. Thank you for watching the video.